Hey everyone, I'm Jay. And I'm Sean. And today we're reviewing Fantasy Island. Fantasy Island, the scary movie, the horror movie. The horror movie. Sean, what are we doing watching a horror movie? I don't know. What are we doing? <gasps> you saw Michael Pena and you're like, might as well. <laughs> I can't say that was my rationale, but quarantine, you know. We've been looking for some good new releases mm -hmm. and striking out a lot. Yeah, but we're definitely striking in all directions. That's true. Mm -hmm. We're equal opportunity strikers. Yes. So yes, I take it that Fantasy Island is actually not just this movie. No, it's an old TV show. Okay. I mean, I kind of, I guess I'm vaguely, I know that I've heard that title before. Yeah. But it seems like it was not an old horror. No, no, it's not. It's, uh, it's before my time. Yeah. So all I know is a little tattoo who is a little person. And the plane would come in and he'd say, the plane bus, the plane. Okay. Something like that. I feel like I know that from a Dunkin' Donuts commercial. Okay, maybe. Oh, you don't even know that? I don't know the Dunkin' oh, Donuts, God, no. I hope I didn't just make that up. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds right. Mm, it's very, does it? <laughs> it I don't like know. A weird it seems thing. like something gold crazy Dunkin' Donuts would do. It it's doesn't just seem very donut though. It's Fantasy Island. Right. <laughs> So in this it, Bloom House's Fantasy Island, it's a bad place. I mean, it would be interesting to see an episode just to see what normally happens there. But in this case, the people who arrive on Fantasy Island, and it's a group of young people, uh, and they get off a plane, I think they all mostly feel like they've won a contest. Or have paid for this or something. Okay. Yeah, um, it's very vague. Okay. And they are all going to have a fantasy of theirs come true. Michael Pena plays Mr. Rourke or something like that. Yeah, right? that's right. And he runs the island. Yes. He seems to always be called Mr. Rourke, so I guess that's a thing. But <laughs> he runs, he's in charge of making all these, well, the island actually makes the fantasies. It's kind of like lost in that way. Okay. There's a lot of talk about the island. The island, yes. The island has its own special powers, and he's working there, getting the people in, and the people say themselves what their fantasy is. <clears throat> but apparently it's a real be careful what you wish for situation, because they don't all turn out to be super fun. No, and even when you think it's going well, then a group of mercenaries will come and take over your hot tub full of supermodels, for example. Good example. Good <laughs> Thank example. you. Well, that's the thing. I mean, uh, Mr. Work does tell us that there is quite a lot of sex stuff. None of these people, of course, are there no. for sex stuff. Nope. They aren't. They're in the minority. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They so, wanted to like redo their uh, proposals or... Yeah, well, not redo. I mean, say yes. Right, but that's like, yeah. But that would like cascade for the past five years and rechange all of our memories. And now like that was a, a lot to swallow. It's super weird. It's super weird. So yeah, there's two guys. All they want to do is party. One woman should have said yes to a proposal and she didn't. Another woman is there because she wants revenge on her high school bully. And we're talking like torture. Torture. Revenge. It's like <laughs> Saw. Yes. So I guess the island can do holograms or whatever. Uh, it certainly, it's popping up a lot of people. Uh, like the two young guys. There were a lot of models in that pool. And the hot tub and the house. There's like five guests, but millions of servants somehow. Yeah. So yes. Was it good, do you think, Sean? Did you no. enjoy it? No. I, I did not think it was good. Okay. I f feel like there was potential here, mm -hmm. and it was very squandered. Squandered. Okay. So it Sean did... Sean has spoken. Yeah, it kept my attention because I was hoping that something would happen to mm -hmm. redeem it. Mm -hmm. It didn't. And really, it got worse. Like, the twist that they had... <laughs> mm -hmm. 
The first twist, okay. There's <laughs> multiple twists, by the way. Mm. The second yeah. twist, oh, it ruins everything. <laughs> In my humble opinion. In your humble opinion, yes. Well, I'll say that it was better than I expected. I mean, I did expect it to be quite bad. And I didn't think it was great, but I survived it. And, like, I was never scared. So that's probably a failing as a horror I movie. think it is. That's a good point. <laughs> uh, I had meant to ask you about that, but you were super calm. Uh, you were, was. like, not grabbing any part of my arm. <laughs> So I did wonder, because it's, I did not find this movie scary mm -hmm. at all. Like, even no. when they're trying to do jumps, you're mm -hmm. like, yeah, okay, there's something behind them, and it's going <laughs> to pop up in the other place than where they think it is. Uh -huh. it, it really, yeah, it's not a horror movie. No. Although, you know, bad things happen. Bad things happen. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And you can, they really can time travel almost. Like the one guy was like playing soldier. That's right. Which I find is a very strange it's fantasy. It's a weird to fantasy. Have. Like, Absolutely. oh, you know what I want to do is get dropped off in the woods and maybe die. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, I think you're doing fantasies wrong, dude. I think so, yeah. <laughs> you know? Just stick with the sex stuff. Yeah, please. Yeah, you're right. I but think then, I would have enjoyed that movie more. Yes. Yes. I know you would have. Yes. <laughs> One of the missed opportunities. <laughs> mm -hmm. But you are right. There's magic happening at every turn mm -hmm. where, whether it's time travel or, yeah, people just showing up out of nowhere mm -hmm. and things that really could not actually be known to mm -hmm. anyone other than the person who was in the fantasy. Mm -hmm. It's just a lot of, it's a, it's a <laughs> fantastical island. It really is. And that's why Mr. Rourke has chosen to protect it. Right. Just like Lost. I mean, you know I didn't watch that show. So. Yeah. <laughs> Need it's basically the me. same thing. Okay. There's like a thing underneath the, the the island that can move it around or like take it back in time. Oh my god. And it has to be protected because it's such a special place. Oh boy. Yeah. Anyway, loss is better. Oh boy. I know. I mean, I'm not sure I agree. Ah, uh, well, it kind of falls apart at <laughs> like for long stretches, but still. <laughs> At least this was only 90 minutes. Yeah, it's a trade-off, but season one of Lost is awesome. Okay. Okay, dear. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, Fantasy Island? Fantasy Island? Fantasy yeah, Fantasy Island. Island. It does sound weird. It does. <laughs> I don't know why. Uh, better than expected for me because I'm a chicken and this was a very bearable horror movie. If you are a fan of horror movies, you might be disappointed in the lack of horror. I think that's really, I don't know who will enjoy this movie. Well, certainly not people who were a fan of the original no, series. No, I can't imagine that it's anything like the original series because no. that for sure was not a horror thing. Mm -hmm. It is not for people who like horror movies no. because it's not scary. Right. It is not for people who like uh, movies to make sense. <laughs> so No, yeah. There's a lot of stuff that's swept under the island rug, you know? <laughs> so who's left? Who is left? Um, like 12-year-olds that want to watch an R-rated movie. I assume this is rated R. I don't know for sure. Well, that's a good point. It doesn't even have to be. For, it's not for that really. dirty. It's not. So, yeah, it's just a movie that exists. Not as bad as I thought, not as good as he hoped. Not as good as I hoped. Mm -hmm. It's not the worst. No, I mean, there are some good points. Uh, in the end, there is a reference to Tattoo, which I only, like, I didn't even get, but I knew must be a reference to the original because it kind of was given that moment, like, 
Hey, wink, wink, yeah, guys. Wink, wink. And I was this like, This is the name of the guy who's I don't know assistant. what you're referencing, but I see the wink. You are winking so hard. That so it's like, hard. We're really uncomfortable now. Yeah. Yeah. If there was, uh, if we had subtitles on, it would have had a wink <laughs> at the yes. bottom for yeah. sure. <laughs> Just a bunch of emojis. Yeah. <laughs> so, not our favorite movie. Uh, no. It's skippable. Yes, it is skippable. But we're skipping less and less because we need new content. That is true. There is a wide open market here mm -hmm. for something good to watch. <laughs> something good. Something good. Come on. Come Let's on, lovebirds. Yes. Yes. Okay, so we're still, all of our hopes are on the, pinned on that one. Kumail. We're counting on you, buddy. Yes. No kidding. No pressure, but all the pressure in the world. Okay, thanks so much for watching, everyone. Let us know if you saw it and what you thought. Bye. Bye.